Hi, Mount Pleasant. Craig here again. Have you ever been on a journey, going somewhere, and suddenly you lose your way? You get a little lost. Well, I know today we all have GPS, that fabulous global positioning system. Um, we have maps, all the great things that we can use to keep us on the right track and the right path. But the truth is, even GPS isn't infallible. Even though it utilizes satellites in the atmosphere, it can be disrupted by weather, power failures, and so much more. For example, one time Valencia and I took a trip to Seattle, Washington. Great trip. We got there, got off the plane, got our rental car, had a great brand new state-of-the-art GPS system. Throughout the course of our trip, it was fine. No issues. Until the day we had to fly back home. So we got in our car and started headed back to the airport, set the GPS, and it took us on a different route. We got a little lost. The GPS took us through some pretty dark and scary roads. Um, thankfully, we left early enough that we were still able to make it to the airport in time for our flight. But the fact is the GPS let us down, and it led us down the wrong path. When Jesus spoke to his disciples about knowing the way, they weren't sure how to get to the destination. Well, Jesus clarified that in uh, the Gospel of John, chapter 14, verses 2 through 6. In my Father's house, he said, are many rooms. If it were not so, would I have told you that I go to prepare a place for you? And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and will take you to myself, that where I, I am you may also be. And you know the way to where I am going. But then Thomas said to him, Lord, we don't know where you are going. How can we know the way? And Jesus said to him, I am the way. Even the disciples weren't sure of the direction or the path to take. But Jesus made it very simple. He explained that you don't need a map, a GPS. You simply need to focus on him and to follow him. He is the true north. He is the way. From here on out, think about that. Moving forward, think about your map, your GPS. What are you following? Pray this today with me. Lord Jesus, I want you to be my global positioning system. I want to follow you and you alone. You are the way, and I dedicate myself to following you today and every day forward. My name is Craig, and my Jesus is the way.